G'day guys, my name's Dave Tran and welcome to another Guitar Zero to Hero song tutorial. And in this lesson, I'll be teaching you how to play Just a Friend to You by Megan Trainer. Now if you want to see my ukulele tutorial on how to play this song, then just head to the link here. So the recorded version of this song is played on ukulele, but I'm going to teach you the guitar chords for this song. So for the basics, you'll just need your guitar and standard tuning, no capo. Now there's a number of different chord shapes in this song, so we'll just get to them as we progress through the different sections. Now if you want to master your chords back to front, then be sure to head over to guitarzerotohero.com to pick up my free guitar ebook. So let's start with a verse, and the verse is a very easy 4 chord chord progression. It goes C, A minor, F, and then G. So we're going to have two strumming patterns for this chord progression. The first one's going to be used for the first three chords, and then the second strumming pattern is going to be used for the last chord. So the first strumming pattern will go like this. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up. And in succession, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up. And the second strumming pattern will go something like this. Down, up, down, up, up, down, up. And one more time. Down, up, down, up, up, down, up. So altogether, the verse will sound something like this. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, up, down, up. And one more time. Now we get to the chorus, and the chorus has four lines of chords that we need to learn. The first line of chords goes D minor, G. C, and then A minor. And for the strumming pattern, we're going to be using that first strumming pattern that we learned in the verse. The one that goes down, down, up, down, up, down, up. And you're going to play that once for each chord. So the first line of chords will sound like this. Now the second line of chords is basically exactly the same as the first, with one small difference. The last chord is A slash C sharp. So to play an A slash C sharp, what you're going to do is you're going to take your index finger and you're going to bar the fourth, third and second strings with your index finger. Don't worry about the first string, you can just sort of mute that. So those strings there, and then with your ring finger you're going to put that on the fourth fret of the fifth string. So index finger on second, ring on fourth. And that's A slash C sharp. And the second line of chords will sound like this. And one more time. Moving on to the third line of chords, we have D minor, G, E slash B. So that's an E major chord, but you're not going to hit the top sixth string. So that's E slash B there. It doesn't matter too much though if you do happen to hit that top string, but it's advised that the bass note is that fifth string. And then the fourth chord is A minor. So the third line of chords sounds like this. And finally, the last line of chords is just D minor and G. Just two chords. So altogether, the chorus will sound like this. And one more time.
And that's it for the chorus. Now after the first chorus, there's a small little break. And that's just two chords. It's just C and G with that same strumming pattern. So it sounds like this. Now note that that is only played after the first chorus. It is not played after the second or third choruses. Now we get to the bridge, which is just a four chord chord progression. And it goes C, A minor, D minor, and G. So the bridge will sound like this. Then after the bridge, then another full chorus, and then we go into an outro. And the outro is just three chords. The three chords are C, D minor, and G. And they're repeated three times. Now, we're gonna use the same strumming pattern, but the only difference here is that the D minor and the G are within one strumming pattern. So the D minor will have the first two down strums, and then the G will have the up, down, up, down, up. So that outro sounds like this. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up. So those are all the parts for Just a Friend to You by Megan Trainer. Now I'm gonna be playing the intro verse and chorus and I'm gonna have my good friend Beck singing on top for context. So play along and see how you go. And that's it for Just a Friend to You by Megan Trainer. If you want any clarification on that, then be sure to check out my chord tab for it in the link below. Don't forget, if you want to learn this on ukulele, I also have a video for that here. So just follow the link over here. Also, make sure you head over to guitarzerotohero.com to pick up my free guitar ebook. Now, if you've enjoyed this lesson, you want to see more, then please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, leave your thoughts, comments, and questions below. And I'll see you next time on Guitar Zero to Hero.